Hello, my name is Keegan. I'm one of the organizers here with the Vancouver Island Airsoft League, and we're very excited to host our next game, Operation First Crisis. Operation First Crisis will use a variety of different props. Props are going to be used at your forward operating base, also known as your FOB, and those props consist of radio towers, ammo crates, and medic tents. The ammo crates are used to keep your team's ammo capacity at its max. If destroyed, it will significantly cut your team's ammo capacity per respawn. To destroy the crate itself, you must lift the lid, which will deploy a blue smoke. Once the lid is lifted and the blue smoke has been deployed, the crate has been destroyed. The radio towers are used to keep stable communications on your team. Once a radio tower is destroyed, your team's communications are destroyed, meaning no electronic radios or communications can be used. To destroy the tower itself, you must split the tower in half and pull the pin on the smoke grenade. Once the blue smoke is deployed and the tower is in half, the team's communications have been destroyed. The last forward operating base asset will be the medic tent. The medic tent will allow you to have a minimal respawn time of 10 minutes and allow the use of an infield medic in game. If the medic tent is destroyed, your respawn time is doubled and the medic itself is out of play until further notice. To destroy the tent, you must pull a pin which will release the arm of the flag and deploy a blue smoke grenade to signify that this resource has been destroyed. FOB resources can be repaired and restored. However, these can only be repaired and restored by the game marshals themselves. Teams cannot reassemble their props, and they will have to be reassembled by one of the refs or game marshals in the area. Each FOB will have a game marshal in that area to help verify that that prop has been destroyed. It's up to your team leaders to help keep stable communications with your teams to let you know what's been destroyed and what to attack next. 